How's it going everyone? My name is Mr. Boss for the win and welcome to another episode of well what I guess you can call Modern Warfare 4 news and insight man that's tough to say. Anyways I know a lot of you guys kind of ragged on me for uh, not necessarily stating news but more speculations and opinions. Today I have actual news for you. The link will be in the description of this article if you wish to read it yourself. Quick note on the gameplay this is me jumping into free for alls trying to go flawless and I guess go for the nuclear metal. Anyways I'm not going to spoil the gameplay. Hope you enjoy, and uh, let's get on with what I want to talk about. So like I said, article will be in the description. It is next quote-unquote Call of Duty game set to launch in late 2013, says Activision. So it's that time again where the next Call of Duty, we're going to call it Call of Duty Modern Warfare 4. The joke they make on the website is like, there's going to be some kids that get really shitty Christmas presents because their mom or grandma or dad's going to go to GameStop and they're going to be like, oh, I want this Call of Duty uh, 4 Modern Warfare. And so one of the store clerks is going to grab them Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare and he's going to be like, man, it's only 10, 15 bucks. What a deal. So some kid's going to get the wrong Call of Duty for Christmas. I'm calling it right now. Anyways, so the CFO of Activision, Dennis Durkin, confirmed the next Call of Duty is already underway. The Call of Duty franchise continues to set the bar for innovation, and we expect the new Call of Duty game in development for 2013 to raise that bar even higher. So, we are going to expect details within the next month, I'm going to assume, simply because... It looks like Activision has more knowledge of the launch of the next consoles than expected. Because if they plan on launching their Call of Duty in 2013, it seems that they're going to be working on it for the Xbox 360 rather than the Xbox 720 and PS4. So, that raises an area of concern. How many people are actually going to be playing these games? Because, let's face it, if an Xbox 720 comes out with an awesome MMO or new shooter that we discover is really awesome, honestly, who's going to want to play on their old Xbox and, you know, game on this really 2006 shitty PC that we play on right now? No one's going to want to do that, I can guarantee you. So, there's definitely going to be people who are not going to be playing the latest Call of Duty if that is the case. But... If Activision knows more knowledge than us and they know that an Xbox PS4 is going to be dropping in, let's say, June of this year, then man, they are really smart guys for planning ahead and making their next Call of Duty on the Xbox 720. Uh, but they say... Uh, they say that Call of Duty 2 really helped launch the Xbox 360 um, game into the next series, so it's possible that it could get ported to the next generation console. What they mean by that is it'll be on the Xbox 360 disc, but it will be available for the Xbox 720. I think that's what they mean, you know. Uh, it might be the fact that they're going to wait it out for the Xbox 720 instead of releasing it for the Xbox 360, PS4. Those are just the names we're coming up with. Those We don't know their final. So, uh, the last real speculation, like I said, at E3 2013, I'm actually not going this year. I got the chance to go last year. It was so much fun. Watch out for that. Um, you know, we went last year, and last year was kind of the year before the big consoles. Um I'm, I'm sure this e year's E3 will be filled with good games as well, but last year was filled with uh, a lot of great games as compared to consoles such as like Assassin's Creed 3, uh, obviously Black Ops 2, Borderlands 2, giant, giant, giant games that are stealing the spotlight, uh, Halo 4 as well, so... Uh, yeah, we're going to have to see if, you know, they're going to hold off and release, uh, you know, if the consoles will be released in 2013 or if they will be released in 2014 and how will that affect the Call of Duty sales. Anyways, guys, like I said, thanks for checking out the video and watching. I want you to do a few things for me. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think about the Call of Duty series migrating to a new console or if it's on this console, how will it affect the sales and play of the game? If everyone wants to jump on the new console, you know, who really knows at this point? Like I said, guys, thanks for checking out the video. Be sure to like, subscribe, do all that great thing. I'm Mr. Boss with Win. Have a great day. I'll talk to you later, and I will see you guys in the next video.